Yehovah Elohim Svaov. Kadosh, Kadosh, Kadosh. Please fill me and lead me and cover me and stir me and speak through me with your Ruach Kodesh, that it may speak your written words with boldness and humility to those who listen. I ask all these things in Yeshua HaMashiach's name. Amen. We'll start with the Shema. Listen and obey. Children of Yehovah, pay careful attention and respond. Yehovah is our power and authority. Yehovah works in unity with himself. And you shall act upon your love to Yehovah with your power and authority, with your thoughts and mind, with your entire body, and with all the muchness that you have. Yod, hey, vav, hey. Hand, behold, nail, behold. Hosea, chapter 3. You have all said to me, Go once more and show love to this wife of yours, who has been loved by her boyfriend, to this adulteress, just as you have all loves the people of Israel, even though they turn to other gods and love the raisin cakes offered to them. So I brought her back for myself with 15 pieces of silver and eight bushels of barley. Then I told her, You are to remain in seclusion for a long time and be mine. You are not to be a prostitute, and you are not to be with any other man. And I won't come in to have sex with you either. For the people of Israel are going to be in seclusion for a long time without a king, prince, sacrifice, standing stone, ritual vest, or household gods afterwards. And afterwards, the people of Israel will repent and seek Yehovah their Elohim and David their king. They will come trembling to Yehovah and his goodness in the Acharat Hayimim. How can we learn to love our Creator for reading this short, fascinating third chapter of Hosea? We can listen and act on the written words of Yehovah, aim to be fruitful and multiply. Aim to remain faithful to who you married. Trust that Yehovah loves his people even though they turn to other gods. Trust that Yehovah is faithful. Keep sex in marriage. Know that even if you feel alone and no one is around you, that Yehovah is there with you. Repent and seek Yehovah your Elohim and David your king. Humble yourself before you have all and trust his goodness is coming. How can we love others as Yeshua loves us? We can proclaim, repent and seek you have all. Bear one another's burdens. Trust that you have all is faithful. Produce spiritual fruit, love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, humility, and self-control. We'll end with the Arianic blessing using the name. Yehovah will kneel before you presenting gifts, and he will guard you with a hedge of protection. Yehovah will illuminate the wholeness of his being towards you, bringing order, and he will provide you with love, sustenance, and friendship. Yehovah will lift up the wholeness of his being and look upon you and set in place all you need to be whole and complete. Shalom, shalom.